Porcupines and hedgehogs look naturally gifted against predators. This is because they are armed with sharp quills that can easily pierce the skins of predators and even damage their vital organs. Most of the time, predators become very curious and try to inspect what's so special about them. Needless to say, this curiosity can even be fatal. With that in mind, let's take a look at the 10 most brutal battles involving hedgehogs and porcupines. Number 10. Porcupine vs. Lion Lions are one of the strongest predators, taking down most prey with relative ease, but they aren't unbeatable. Besides animals like elephants, rhinos, and hippos, lions can also face defeat when going up against porcupines. Even though porcupines do not have the size advantage, they can beat lions, all thanks to their pointed quills. In this clip, several young lion cubs surround a porcupine and try to attack. The young predators simply don't know just how dangerous this small animal can be. As they try to attack it, the porcupine uses its quills to defend itself. Some of these prickly thorns even brush against the cubs' skins. It doesn't take long for the cubs to realize their mistake, and they get the hell out of there. A pride of lions is feeling a bit cautious and tries to attack a porcupine. Despite being encircled, the porcupine warns all of them to back off and threatens to harm them with its quills. It's surprising that adult lions would try to attack a porcupine, knowing full well of the dangers involved. Maybe the pride was just too desperate for food. Number 9. Porcupine vs. Leopard Leopards, just like their larger cousins, the lions, commit the same mistake of underestimating porcupines as prey. When they face off with these prickly opponents, things can sometimes go wrong for the leopard. In some documented cases, leopards have even lost their lives trying to assault a porcupine. The leopard is constantly irritating a porcupine in the middle of the road. It tries to overpower the porcupine, but every attempt fails. That's because this porcupine constantly shows its back armed with sharp quills. After a while, you can see the leopard's paws are bloody, and a few quills seem to have pierced its skin. In this one, two leopards take on two porcupines. They approach with utmost care, trying their best not to get injured by those quills. However, noticing the imminent threat, the porcupines take evasive action and launch an attack. In the end, the leopards are left licking their wounds and trying to get the quills out, even as the porcupines escape. This one is quite shocking. The leopard has caught hold of the porcupine's neck and is carrying it away. But can you really say that the big cat has won the fight? Just take a look at all the quills puncturing its face. Perhaps catching this porcupine came at too high a cost. Number 8. Hyena vs. Porcupine The hyenas are known to target almost every animal in their habitat. As a predator, hyenas are extremely brutal and very impatient too. Armed with a strong bite force and the ability to work together as a clan, the hyenas still can't take down porcupines. Two hyenas, a cub and an adult, are loitering around a porcupine. The porcupine displays its quill-filled back and walks around the hyenas. The scared hyenas slowly back off as the porcupine approaches. The younger hyena just stares at the porcupine and does not know what to do next. Number 7. Snake vs. Porcupine Snakes usually avoid porcupines because of their quills, but sometimes they, like other predators, can become curious and commit the big mistake of swallowing or attacking a porcupine. The snake attacks the porcupine's back, but the defense is so strong, the porcupine retaliates by hitting it with its spike. We wonder who could have won at the end of this encounter. Now take a look at this one. The snake that looks like a boa constrictor seems to have wrestled with a porcupine. Now, its quills have punctured all over the serpent's body. Not only is this painful for the snake, it might very well lead to its death soon. Number 6. Dog vs. Porcupine Dogs usually tend to be curious, and that's why they sometimes get in trouble. That trouble can be serious, especially when confronted with a porcupine. Despite dogs having furs, the porcupine's quills are just too sharp and may even penetrate all that covering. The pit bull looks adventurous and has spotted a porcupine in the mud. The dog proceeds to attack and tries to bite the animal, but those quills make this a truly difficult prospect. The dog's whole mouth and body is covered with those quills in no time. It tries to get them out using its mouth. How painful that must be for the mutt. This dog has lost a fight with a porcupine, and the quills are stuck all over its face and mouth. The gums are pierced with those quills, too. The dog is given anesthesia so that it falls asleep before each quill is removed painstakingly. The moral lesson for the dog is that there is no point fighting with a porcupine. In the next clip, 
The dog was perhaps badly wounded in a fight with a porcupine. There are so many quills stuck in the dog's body. The animal cries helplessly and obviously in a lot of pain. As the quills are removed, the poor dog bleeds profusely. Hope this mutt recovers and learns the valuable lesson. Number 5. Bear vs. Porcupine Bears are some of the largest omnivores in the world. When hungry, they stop at nothing, they attack other animals, and love stealing too. However, their confrontations with porcupines are unlike any other. The bear observes a porcupine and approaches it. The porcupine does not seem to be bothered much. It shows its back and exposes the quills. As soon as one of the quills touches the bear's face, it backtracks. This was a smart bear that realized how dangerous the situation is and got out when he could. The bear curiously stares at the porcupines and gets close to them. The two porcupines look quite relaxed and threaten the bear. The porcupine warns the large animal not to come any closer. In the end, the bear rightly decides not to attack the porcupines. Most animals that battle it out with porcupines have scars to show for it. This bear's nose, for instance, is covered with quills. Even though it may seem like a minor inconvenience to us, the bear is surely suffering each moment that those quills are buried deep inside its face. Number 4. Hedgehog vs. Snakes Hedgehogs, like porcupines, have the same skin filled with sharp quills. The hedgehogs may be a bit smaller, but have the good fortune of pricking their wannabe predators. And when it comes to predators, hedgehogs often have to fend themselves against snakes. In this clip, a cobra is fast approaching a hedgehog. The hedgehog has no idea that it is being followed. Finally, both face each other. Without thinking at all, the cobra broadens its hood and strikes at the hedgehog. The hedgehog bites back and the cobra leaves. What an embarrassing defeat for the so-called strong cobra. The snake is checking the hedgehog that has coiled into a ball. Finally, the serpent strikes it hard. However, the snake's teeth can't get through those quills and hard exterior. Realizing this, the snake moves off. Number 3. Jackal vs. Porcupine Jackals are intelligent creatures that may sometimes take too much risk. With porcupines, they don't stand any chance and yet are foolish to target them. The jackal is loitering around a porcupine. The cautious porcupine widens its back and warns the jackal not to come nearby. The jackal moves away and realizes that the odds are a bit too much against it. Number 2. Fox vs. Hedgehog Foxes love to take shortcuts and that's why they target smaller animals. But hedgehogs are no ordinary rodents and can seriously injure any fox, irrespective of its hunting experience. This fox has spotted a hedgehog. It silently moves towards it for a quick snack. As soon as it takes a bite, the fox realizes its mistake and backs off. The hedgehog remains in its coiled up defensive state. Number 1. Cat vs. Hedgehog Cats are curious creatures and there is a saying that curiosity can be deadly for them. In a confrontation between cats and hedgehogs, the cats do not stand much of a chance. Despite having sharp claws and jaws, they can't get through the hedgehog's defenses easily. A cat and a hedgehog are eating something together. So far so good and there's no trouble. The hedgehog then snatches away the meal and refuses to share it anymore. Despite being bigger, the cat just couldn't do anything to protect itself. It sits and watches as the hedgehog has its food too. In the next clip, the cat tries to play with the hedgehog, but it hurts as the hedgehog is just too prickly. The cat then tries to lie on top of the thorny animal, but quickly reacts when the quills poke its skin. Even though the cat just wants to play, the hedgehog isn't an ideal playmate. So, tell us your views on porcupines and hedgehogs. Do inform us how the video changed your perception of these two prickly animals in the comments section. We think those quills may offer them a lot of safety against predators. Fortunately, they seem to only use them in defense. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and share it with your friends and family. In case you are interested in similar videos, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon and turn on all the notifications for regular updates. Have a great day and we hope to see you soon in another exciting video.